Okay, so I just need to talk to you really quickly about lighthouse chart markings. Now, if you've got a map, so we're looking at our map here, and there's lighthouses on the map, the lighthouses will be marked with this information or something that looks like this information. So I'm just going to run you through what that information means. Okay, so F1 means flashing. Now, what does flashing mean? Flashing means short bursts of light. So a short burst of light with long darkness. Short burst of light, long darkness. Short, short burst of light, long darkness. So flashing. Now if you compare that to a different um, lighthouse, this is, stands for, uh, I'll just write it down here so you guys can see it, occulting. Okay. Now occulting means long light, short darkness. Long light, short darkness. Long light, short darkness. Okay, so that's the difference between flashing and occulting. And lighthouses will be either flashing or occulting. Not, they can't be both. So, looking at this lighthouse, this is our first lighthouse, it's going to flash three times. So it's going to go bing, bing, bing. So it's three flashes. And then, is our second part, it's going to wait 12 seconds. So, bing, 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 1, 1,000, 2, and then it, complete darkness for 12 seconds, and then it's going to go again. Bing, bing, bing. Okay, so be careful there. So, it flashes three times, and then it waits 12 seconds. Some people get confused, and they think it means 12 seconds between each flash. It doesn't mean that. It means three short flashes and then wait 12 seconds. Now, if we look at the second lighthouse in this in this list, it's occulting. It's going to occult twice and then it's going to wait five seconds. So that's going to look like this. Long flash, whoop, long flash, whoop, wait five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Long flash, boop. long flash, boop. wait five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that's our two different types of lighthouse flashing patterns. Now, this number can change, so it could be four flashes or five flashes or two flashes. This number can change the time that it takes. And the idea is that lighthouses along the coast are all going to have um, individual flash patterns, so you know which lighthouse it is. Last two bits. Uh, this is how tall the lighthouse is. Okay, That helps you identify it as well. It also helps you, and you're going to find this out, it also helps you figure out how far away from the lighthouse you are if you know how tall it is. So this one's 62 metres tall, this one's 78 metres tall. And finally, this last bit here is the visibility. That is, how far away from the lighthouse can you be and still see it? So this one is 10M. The M, in this case, I know this is confusing, the M stands for nautical miles. Okay, so that one can be seen from 10 nautical miles away. This one can be seen from 12 nautical miles away. And also, uh, this gives you an idea of how close you are to the lighthouse, which is important because you don't want to run into the thing. That's lighthouses.